What's up, everybody? <laughs> Gaming. I still love how these are the same price. Like, <laughs> genius. Ready, sir. Genius, man. I'll let you off at these coordinates. Oh, man, I still have so many points. I don't know if any more in. Maybe one more AT gun? Yeah, like right here? Although he could have like an LG here. Uh. Yeah, but I mean, why not? Should be good. And then the hundred points. I don't know. Doesn't really matter. Obviously, I want to go into here. I just. Where are we 
could always try to roll me up here too. So. I mean, other than that, I could literally just fucking cue force minute. Yeah, I might as well from the get go. Why not? Taxi ready. I'll get you there as soon as possible. Uh, I should have gotten something for the church. I should have gotten there. Oh, you're right. Uh, yeah, and if something's problematic, we could buy a bowfighter right off the bat, but four falls has a good AA piece, so probably not. Really the only thing I'm even marginally worried about is like the auto cannon car spam. But like that, that's literally it. Careful! Nearby! Nice units, bro. We did it! My saboteurs! Everybody out! Any orders? Wait for me! Yeah! Back! Back! Any orders? Spacing! One more hit and one dot. One more kill! AC gun, primed and ready! Careful, homie, take it! Fucking down! Right. Oh, I forgot this. Oh boy. We need more feet here! New form and ready! Out there, shoot first, then ask questions later. Fuck it down! Red Devils, at your orders. Down! Go, Rupert! That's gonna be problematic, so I kinda have to. Between war and dishonor, I choose war. Oh, he's just gonna be. Oh, right, because he doesn't see it, because they're all raider. Right. How silly of me. Bye, Yeager. Oh, he doesn't have AA. Snipers! He's burning! Facing! Front 
about too much. I'm floating 400 points. Really, let's... Let's get some mortars. We need morphine here! Like... Enemy engaged! I am not playing well we in any, uh, like any capacity, but I don't need to. He's down! I don't need to. We need morphine here! Raid, sir. And it's still 12 tone. Enemy can't do it. And this is the map he picked, so I don't want to hear like post game cope or whatever. Is it lag? Oh, he might be lagging. I was lagging today against Insha, but Insha was hosting, so maybe it's just me. I don't really know. Maybe I have to shut off the YouTube stream. Yes, sir. All right. I mean, that's fair. Like, if he's lagging. And ready. I know. I know how painful that can be. Ready. But still, like, your knives, I, I just. It doesn't. We got a man down. Ready, sir. Copy that, sir. Got a man down! Gun! Not a copy! 
Where are they? If he's lagging, then I understand. Yeah, Q and R are the only commands for infantry, but, uh, like, <laughs> I mean, I don't know. Like, usually I have to, like, micro in between uh, buildings and stuff to be uh, just smarter about it. But, uh, I don't know. What was the KD? Yeah, I mean, he was still getting out-traded in A on a mirror income. Um, a lot of those points were in planes, which once I get... I mean, to be fair, mine were too. But like, yeah, I mean, I, I can invest equally in planes, out-trade in infantry. Because like, it doesn't matter. Because it's, infantry is bread and butter. It's the only thing that, like... When push comes to shove, infantry is like the number one thing. Uh, and this division's infantry is just so good that, like, it doesn't matter that you don't have AA, it doesn't matter uh, that you don't have vehicles. And you still do get vehicles, you just get them in B, which, you know, that, that's not a long wait, some, like, if you play Sikarums, you have to wait till C to get vehicles, really, other than two Recon Panthers or whatever. It, this, and, and you get really good vehicles, you get Shermans, super cost effective, and the fucking uh, 2k howitzer, uh, the M10, you even have the cheaper jeeps, the cheaper resupply jeeps to re uh, resupply the APCR, so you always have 2k range. <laughs> it's just unbelievable. Um, yeah, this division is just, just, I don't know. But we're gonna rematch since he was lagging, and I know how, uh, yeah, it's... I'm also trying to convince him here, but uh... So you guys say sorry. Uh, four Falschemegers pre DLC. Yeah, I mean, yeah, yeah, I mean, four, yeah, four falls is still like really insanely good. <laughs> um, like that hasn't changed. It's like it will still outclass almost any of the older divisions. But yeah, ATF just outclasses it by another. Uh, <laughs> Oh, uh, but it's like, it's like a fucking staircase, and ATF is like on the top of the, like, four small stream makers used to be on top of the staircase, but, uh, a new stair was added, and now ATF sits there. tired of arguing over text. It's like so much is lost. And so many people try to place him in. Who is this guy? Who? Are you ghost? Yeah, I'm ghost.
Um, yeah, so you don't get the crazy Forceman Homer, but you do get the bro <laughs> the bugged and broken Centaur, which is underpriced. I feel like even if they fix the aim time, it's still insanely underpriced. Like, if you compare it to an SU-76 or literally, like, anything else, like, I don't know, man. Um, but... Yeah, like a West. Like, oh my god, dude. <laughs> Uh, I don't think we're gonna play. I think Inch was in her, uh, not Inch, Baron's internet is too bad. Um, so now I have no one to play against. Uh, I mean, I don't know. I can, I can queue on, like, I did, did this with 5th through Bergzinger, and I think a lot of people are sleeping on that division too. Um, I mean, I think it's outmatched now by ATF as well, but... Oh, it's just like... I don't know. All the divisions are cool, but they're all really spammy, like... I was even looking at Tatao, and I'm not saying this division is overpowered, but I was playing a game on Orsha North, and it's like, <laughs> look at all this cheap infantry, 10 point infantry, I don't know, like, obviously individually it's bad, but like, I could ignore a whole flank, right, and then buy like 12 of these for 120 points, like, you can buy your whole card's worth in one minute, and just like, overwhelm him in numbers, you know what I mean? It's just really silly spam, I don't, like, it's not good gameplay. Um, but, yeah, I mean, I, I'm not gonna go too hard on it, because it's not like... I, I, <laughs> like, again, all the divisions are cool. I love how they added the G14. Like, look at this thing, this thing is fucking just... It's, it, everything is cool. It's cool, but I just... It, it's also cancerous. Every, everything is just like... <laughs> It's just, just bad gameplay. Um, oh shit. Maybe he does want to play. Still, hold on. I have to remake the lobby then. Um, if you, if I make it private, you guys can still spectate from the game, right? I think so. I'm just gonna do it. Yeah, obviously the centaur isn't going to stay bugged, but again, um, I mean, I'm only speculating here. I can't, like, I'm not going to make definitive closed statements like I'm trying to make here with ATF, but, um, I, again, like, they said the only thing was bugged was the aim time, but to me, the rate of fire and, like, the, the suppression, like, I remember Tanner was playing a game against me in quick play, and I was playing ATF, and... I, I completely like out trade a Tanner by UKD, but like his centaurs were the only thing I guess holding me back, if that makes sense. Like, and it, cause it was impressive. Like, obviously, when you have slower aim time, that's uh, gonna reduce that ability. Oh, sorry, yeah, I will. Um, yeah, I know my audio, uh, audio balance is bad. <laughs> I never get it right. Uh, I can make the hold on. Let me make my desktop audio like 10 decibels quieter. Because I still want to listen to my music, but. Hopefully that's better. You could let me know. I don't stream often or make any videos, so I'm not. I'm not good at this. <laughs> Alright, 
come back. Is it is it better? Can somebody tell me in chat? Or or just Okay. Cool.
still waiting for Farad. Uh, but I don't want to sit here and wait like all day. We'd be rather playing a different game on us. <laughs> it was just, I, uh, I don't know. I just hope more people <laughs> realize what the fuck is wrong. Like I don't it's it's just like so obvious to me that it actually hurts me when when other people like can't see something so obvious. It's it's like showing It's like, "Hey, do you see that building?" No, I don't. It's like, "What the fuck do you mean you don't?" It's it's right in we're in an open field. There's literally one building. It is as tall as a skyscraper and you're telling me you don't see it? It's it's like like how, how do you work with someone like that? Like, I don't know. Like, I just feel like I'm being trolled. And, and, and then it's like, you, you see this building, and it's just like, well, maybe you're just re being really egotistical, or overreacting. It's like, what the fuck are you saying? <laughs> like, <laughs> oh my. And also, I don't understand this idea of, like, I, I understand when there's, like, different opinions. Um, yeah. Yeah, like, yeah, obviously people can have different opinions and things like politics and stuff, but sometimes there's just, like, objective things that you can legitimately point to. And they'll still deny it because it goes against their worldview or whatever. And it's just like at that point, what do you do? Like, legitimately, what do you like? There's nothing else. There's nothing else that can be done. They are emotionally tied to it. Um, like, I usually don't feel very strong about things unless I am like 100% certain I'm right about it. If I'm ever unsure about something, I'm like thinking I'm gonna be like. I'm gonna like nuance it or like uh, put caveats, right? Caveats is like the big thing where I'm just like, yeah, like, uh, like I I think this, but like, if you show me something else that disproves that, then yeah, then I guess then you would be right in that case. But I still believe this until you show me that thing that disproves me, then I'm gonna be keep believing by it. Like, it's just, but like, like forcemen. They're better than Legion, like, Brandenburgers used to be 30 points a long time ago. They got nerfed to 35, because they would be too strong at 30. Uh, same thing with Legionnaires. So why have we added Forcemen, which are literally better than both those units? Maybe, or maybe equivalent to Brandenburgers, right, if you want to make that argument. Why have we made them 30 points again? Like, why are we repeating the same balance mistakes ages ago, right? Um... Yeah, sure, numeric evidence is needed from games and stuff, but again, like, 
so there <laughs> at some point it's so obvious that the unit just doesn't make any sense and uh maybe maybe you don't see it from the stat card right but you jump into a game and you can very quick like if something has like 20 uh damage right um it's like you go into a game and you're one-shotting every squad it's kind of obvious right forcemen are basically that but like a step down like <laughs> Like, it's the same thing with the Centaur. Like, there's, like, no playtesting. Um, and again, I know the Strike Team is super limited, and Eugene is super retarded. Like, absolutely fucking brain-dead dog shit company. Um, but, like, like does the Strike Team not playtest these things? Or, like, why were opinions split on the Forcemen? I don't understand how we get to these things. Yeah, but... I mean, if it's not obvious to them, then quite frankly, they're just stupid, and their opinion should be discarded. Like, it, it's that simple. Like, not all opinions are valid. Not all opinions are equal. You can't tell me, and come to me and say, vaccines cause autism, when there's fucking nothing proving that, and you have a billion experts telling you otherwise. Like, <laughs> I don't care if it's not obvious to them at that point. If it's not obvious to them, then they can stay delusional for the rest of their lives. We don't need to listen to them or respect them or anything like that. That's far, like, we are far too nice and complacent to these types of people. And, like, I realize I can't force them to change, but we can definitely not listen to them. Like, I can, I can respect perspectives, right? I can, I can listen to someone who's like a flat earther and be like, well, how did you get to that, uh, like, how did you come to that reasoning, right? Um, and it's like, you can listen to that and entertain why they, uh, I know it's dangerous. I know, I don't know, man. It's just... In, in politics, I would agree with you, but not in fucking video game balancing purposes. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I, I think some context here definitely matters in that sense. Um, but yeah, I, I know what you mean. Like in in twenty, I mean, I'm, I I lean more left for sure. And like part of like Trump winning was just like um, a lot of people just thinking like these ideas were ridiculous. Like who would believe this? And then it turns out like half of America does, right? Um, yeah, but. Okay, I don't think Farid is coming. Do uh two one quick play game or something. Or just a, who's who's the poor bastard that's gonna get rolled in a minute or two? Yeah, but. The practice of not listening to people can get great to some people. I I guess, but at the same time, I don't know. It it, it it's not like they're listening to us either, right? Um, you you can present them a different uh ana like a hundred different analogies or a hundred different facts or studies or whatever, and none of them will listen to you. Uh, and it's like I was reading an article about estranged parents yesterday, um, and how a lot of these parents like uh. Their, their kids hate them, right? Their kids hate their parents, they cut all contact with them, and they legitimately don't remember or understand why their child hates them this much. Um, 
Uh, and even though the child will, will spell it out to them clearly, they'll trivialize, trivialize everything they say or just completely uh, think they're like lying to them or whatever. Like they won't, like their, their ears are completely closed off. Um, and to change these people, you can almost try to. You have to be so gentle, so civil. Uh, you have to tread very carefully to even get them to listen to the, like, the tiniest sliver of negative feedback. But if you cross that line at all and, or, or go too hard on them, they immediately close down, get defensive, and again, it's like they're deaf, right? Um, so it's just like, I don't, I don't know what to do with these people. I really don't. Um, Like, I know it's not a good thing to say, and I know it's a very bad view, but, like, I, I almost legitimately see them as, a, as, like, subhuman. And I know that's such a bad take, but it's, like, emotionally, I, I can't help but feel like that, you know what I mean? It's just, like, uh, I don't know. Anyways, he's playing to Tao. Uh, he's gonna get rolled in. Do you guys want to take bets? He's playing balanced. Uh, anyone want to bet how quickly he loses on Schlutzk? We can do like the price is right, but uh, <laughs> how quickly the game will end. Good luck, have fun, but it's really good luck having fun with against this division. Should have put more snipers than men, but who cares?
I mean, another division that's super good that you guys might not realize is like Fifgerberg's. It, it plays in a very similar uh, fashion. Um, the only difference is you, you don't get like retarded units like Forcemen, but you do get super cheap tanks with the Stugs. Um, so you can argue it's a little bit better on these open maps, but honestly they're both just crazy, crazy, crazy strong. I'm, I'm good, Will. Just arguing with people I see is retarded. I, what what what's changed? I just I just love to get down into the mud and roll around, you know, like a fucking pig. Oh, not my forcemen. Oh my god, he knows. Snipers. <laughs> One shot. Tragic, man. Did I get the nade off? I don't even know. Attack move! <laughs> Oh, I forgot the smoke. Uh, anything worth nuking? Yeah, this is worth nuking. Goodbye! I want you off the map. Yeah, they're all running here. I'll just do that. We'll get a smaller bomber for that IG. Oh my god, he stopped it. He, he had it planned out. Doesn't matter. You misplay, doesn't matter. He's got A there, he doesn't have A here. Oh. It's that simple. Any orders? Spacing! Any orders? Down. He's got a bomber. Look, you're all raider, so they're all really fast. I guess oh I'm sorry, I'm breaking it. I'm not Q moving anymore. I gotta press R. That was a terrible bombing strike anyways. Kill mode! <laughs> We dealt with this. Down. Eyes open for Jerry. Down. We need more feet here. Airborne ready, sir. Look on sight. Four L. Two pas. Vous passez devant. We need more feet here. Sharpen your knives, lads. Ammo check. Jerry's dead. Back. Back. Oh guys, look how much infantry he's got here. Shame it doesn't matter. <laughs> Two damage. Big. And he's got like what, ten little bombs? Do you think we're a tank? We're paratroopers. We're supposed to be surrounded. I wonder if he'll even spot the recon. Sir, yes, sir. At your orders, Captain. Putain, on l'a eu. Airborne ready, sir. Jack is down. I have nothing else planned for this afternoon. Ready to fire. We need morphine here! At your orders. Yes, pleasure. For God's sake! Jack is down! Scouts, at your orders. No. I'm fine. Let's get out of oh, here. not. Red Devil, Tragic. at your orders. We need morphine here! Uh. Safety's 
hands off, soldiers. Shoot on sight. Yes, sir. We need more feet, here! We're special forces, sir. We know what to do. We're losing, it's tragic. We need more feet here! We fix them, you flank them. Sniper's good guys, they're not even in cover. Sniper's good. Watch this guys, I'm gonna Q move. I'm gonna look away. <laughs> oh my goodness. Guys, <laughs> amazing here. gameplay. Need some extra eyes, sir. Yes, sir. Fuck it down. Uh, these We're are both AB rifles. We'll leave them back. Ready, sir. I retreat. Back. Don't worry, guys. In two minutes, we get tanks. Okay, three snipers versus two MG42s. Who? <laughs> oh, and a sniper. And we're not in cover. Tragic. We lost. Incredible. We're listening to you. We lost. Yet, these will come back up. The sniper will die, and it's going to be a one v. It's gonna be a 3v2 or whatever next time instead of yes. a 3v3. He's burning. Or I guess no. Well, this unit okay. hasn't participated, so we can't we can't really say it's done anything. Ready, dead. Ready, sir. Guys, push back in. Or, you know, I get the mortars. You know, the really good ones that were only available to the really good division. Uh -huh. Well, let's add it to another really good division. That would be smart. Enemy spotted. Be ready. 
We send tanks one here, one here, call it a day. Oh my god, how could he? Where do you need us? We need more feet here. Oh guys, we're doing it. We're almost taking this forest. He's tried really hard to hold it. Okay, we're out of range of the MG, right? So he's got a huge advantage right now. In fact, like, surely he can stop it in time. Surely! Move everything over, right? They're all in open cover. Can, can he stop it? Oh, snipers have entered range. Oh, he's suppressed one. Oh, the other one doesn't have a line of sight. Yep, yeah, Oh my god. Oh, but he can't he can't keep up the suppression on them all. And now he's getting suppressed. And now he can't shoot as fast. Can he so kill this one in time? Oh my god, he did it. But you know, if I was using Panzergrenz, which were the same price, I wouldn't even have damaged him. I wouldn't have even gotten close. Isn't that funny? But with snipers, with snipers anything is possible. I don't want a micro, so we're just gonna put these on fire at will. Because you know, why would you micro in a video game? Why would you play the video game? Why not watch the cinematic experience? Sorry. <sighs> For God's sake. We're hit. Drop 200. Six rounds. Over. We're under fire. Locked and loaded, sir. We're hit. Yeah, there's not really much in anything else to say. Ready to pound them, sir. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it, yeah, it's like people were like, "Wow, it's so cinematic!" Wow, look at the graphics! And like, "Wow, I don't care. This is like the most unbalanced fucking game in the world." It's like. <laughs> Like, I don't know, it, it's just that the fact is, like, yeah, RTSs are hard, but they're, they're supposed to be. They're supposed to be difficult, like, um, that's, like, chess isn't easy. Like, that's, I know that's a turn-based game, but, like, it, it's, it's, it kind of, like, is the same feeling you get from it, right? Like, you're supposed to be thinking, outplaying, um, it's a very... It's all on you, right? Um, and I think people can't handle that anymore. Uh, people can't handle the fact that they're like... Um, like, in, in a general sense, like, it, it just feels suck. Like, if you 
boot up this game and you lose every single time, it, it's gonna, like, for a lot of people, a lot of people can't handle that. Um, I've lost more games than probably most people have played, right? Like, it's... But, like, every time I lose, I think, okay, I'm fucking shit at this game, holy fuck, I wanna kill myself, but let's do better. Let's make sure I never feel like this again. Uh, you know, and I guess, and, and like a lot of people just aren't wired like that, but then it's like, why are you playing this game? Why are you trying to like decide how, like, there there are cinematic games or whatever, um, like why not, I don't know. I might lose this? No, dude. Like, the only reason it doesn't even look that good is because I haven't been trying at all. Um, but like, he hasn't ticked at all. Look at that. Um, and we're still in the B phase. Like, we're not even gonna get the C. There's nothing, there's nothing to lose here. Like, even if he bombs and kills all this and grabs this flag, like, so what? Um, like, this might turn into 10 minutes when he grabs the flag, right? But it still doesn't matter. Because I'm about to grab this flag and I can reach for that flag too. Like, it, does he... I'm sorry, buddy, but he never had a chance. <laughs> no, if I was playing against a better player, um, I'd definitely be trying a lot more. Um, and they still probably wouldn't have much of a chance, but... Yeah. Like, I'm not, I'm not gonna sit here and be like, Oh, this division is... Um, how do I put it? super easy to play for a beginner, right? Like, because you lack these tools, it's not obvious, um, probably to a lot of people how to play it, but... I mean, once you learn that infantry is everything and anything in this game, um... I don't know, you just... It's... It's, it's hard to say, again. Because I, I lack the perspective, because I've played so much of this game that... Like, I, I don't know... It's harder to emphasize with a newer player than it is with like a good player, right? For me, at least. Because I always know why I lost. No, that's not even true. Uh, that becomes more true as I play uh, the game more. Um, but like, sometimes I don't know why I lost. Sometimes I legitimately don't know what else I could change. But. When I'm faced with a problem like that, I don't just like say I don't I don't give up. I might be very angry and I might be very frustrated, uh, but like I'll queue up a game in another five minutes um, after I've calmed down a bit and just figure it out. Um, yeah, exactly. It's it's like playing chess, but like it's just like yeah, that's a that's a very apt analogy, uh, Tanner. Yeah, I mean, in general, I wasn't looking forward to the trait changes at all, but, um... But it's not like we can solely blame Strike Team for that. Uh, yeah, before release, I, I was worried about it, like, even Attack Power was worried about it, like... Because the game was, like, at, like, it's not perfect, no game is, but, like, it was okay. Um... There were still some Q-move divisions. Again, I still think everyone is sleeping on 5th Gebirgsjäger, but like now it's completely overshadowed by ATF, so what, it, what am I here to say? Um, but... Yeah, it just like... I, I could see the... we I, A lot of us could see the writing on the wall, and it's really frustrating when it's just like, you guys are just overreacting. And it's just like, are we? Because I had, I had bad feelings coming. Like, a lot of... Yeah, I don't know. It's just... <laughs> At some point, we're all gonna run out of it. Yeah, and by the way, um, I played a game against Jellyman. I was playing third Canadian. He was playing first ATF, right? I outtraded him by at we. Uh, he was playing Vanguard. I was playing Maverick. I outtraded ATF by a thousand KD, and he still won. <laughs> I couldn't. Uh... Wait, this was Daniels. This wasn't even a bad player. <laughs> Oh my god, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. <laughs> I just realized... <laughs> I'm 
I'm sorry. I, I, I was completely disrespecting him. And it just... Yeah. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm done, guys. Y'all enjoy yourself. Take it easy. I'm gonna play Armored Core 6 or Baldur's Gate 3. Those are good games. Those are good games. CIL? Hold on. CIL is really strong. But I think it's one of those divisions that isn't OP because... Um, it's AT is really bad. I think CIL is AT is really... Like, yeah, you get 17 pounders, but like... Against a good player, you, you, you start to get to a point where you lack. Um, you have a few piots, but most of your piots aren't on the good infantry. Uh, C CIL is, again, it's like one of those divisions that's manageable, even if it's a bit stronger than everything else because of his retarded CQC. Um, it's not like... That's my opinion, at least, though. I, I, I think... I think CIL is fine, and it's got really slow transports as well. If its transports were faster, it would be uh, it would be a lot stronger too, like because you'd be able to keep up the pressure a lot more. Um, so yeah, I think I think CIL is fine, even though it is really strong, especially on a high level. Um, but yeah, it's it's but this this is like you get tractions. <laughs> Why? Why do we keep adding tractions in A when every single time we have to have it nerfed? Um, and then. Yeah, it was like we, we added uh, Forcemen, which are better Legionnaires at 30 points. Why? It's just so many whys. So many same mistakes, so many problems. I, yeah. Anyways, I ran through long enough. I'm tired. <laughs>